Hey, what's up everybody? Did you know that 96,000 people move to Las Vegas every single year? The question is why? Well, due to the Fed's interest rate hikes have increased the cost of living for many Americans across the country. Americans are now looking to relocate to Las Vegas because of no state income tax, low unemployment, low cost of living, and affordability for housing. We're also the entertainment capital of the world. So if you are thinking about relocating to Las Vegas, we would like to offer you a free Southern Nevada market report and a relocation guide. All you have to do is click on that link below to claim yours today. All right, what's up everybody? Another day, another property home tour. So today I'm out here on the west side of the Las Vegas Valley. Now we are just right off of Buffalo and Sahara. Sahara is going to be over here. Buffalo is going to be right down here, less than about five minutes. You have nothing but grocery shopping. You have the Auto Mall just right over here on Sahara too as well. Every food ethic group you can think about. Literally everything is at your footsteps. So today we're going to be touring this lovely home. And this home was actually built in 1989. However, this home has been fully remodeled. We spent over about $700,000 on this remodel. Now, this home features 3,763 square feet, five bedrooms, total of four baths. As you can see, we have a two-car garage here. And then look at this. We have another two-car garage right here off to the uh, side. Let's take a look at this neighborhood as well. Look how wide the streets are. You don't get this anymore here in Las Vegas. The reason why this is so popular is because these are all a bunch of custom homes that you have like half acre lots. Now, let's take a look at this. The curb appeal, the landscaping, completely redone. Now, I was told there was actually like a fence all the way around here and it was like a dirt mound with a couple palm trees. They flattened everything out. This is real grass, guys. Love that. You do have a lot of lights as well for the uh, landscaping. Also, I want to give a quick shout out to Luca. This is their luxury collection presented by Home Smart Encore. Now, this home is facing west, so a lot of your sun exposure is going to be on this side. As you can see, they painted the driveway, did all the landscaping, beautiful curb appeal. The exterior has been painted as well. Beautiful Wisconsin lighting. Everything has been completely redone. All right, let's make our way inside. Let's see what we got here. I'm very excited to show you. Now, the price on here is $1,798,500. All right. First thing I notice, we have the ring doorbell. We have a custom door here. Keypad, which is really nice. As we come in, I'm gonna kind of show you guys the lay of the land here. So this floor plan is completely open. Look at that. Look at the skylights. So right over here we have a bedroom and also the primary. You have the den, and we have a few more bedrooms down this way. Beautiful pool, so I can't wait to show you that. But let's start off on this side. So. Back to the front entryway, looks like we have orange peel texture, half inch on the bull nose. Beautiful chandelier as you walk right in. Two-tone paint. You've got the 24 by 48 on the uh, tile. They did a really good job laying this tile with the straight edge cornering on here. So let's head down this way. So we have the primary here. Then another bedroom down this way. So we'll probably start off down here. Carpets are nice and plush. It feels like an eight pound pad to me. Now, if you guys want more information as far as like the dimensions on it, I will have a link in the description below. So we have 10 foot ceilings, double stack. Now I've noticed that they sanded all this down. So we have a smooth texture with the color blocking here. And if you notice, all these light switches here, okay, these are all connected through Wi-Fi. So this is actually a smart home, which is really nice. You can literally control the pool, 
the light. This is a quality glass here. Look at this slide. Look how beautiful this thing just slides. 12 by 24 towel. Got the uh, soap box with the Schluters. Brand new tub. Under mounted sink. This is like a four inch casing around the door. Now, what I like about this neighborhood, there's like really no HOAs here. Like if you guys want a property with no HOAs, this is where you're gonna get it. We got additional, oh, closet. However, there's some things in there. We're just gonna bypass that. Now, this is what I like about this. Linen closet, pull outs. So just understand, just to do the cabinets is one price. The front face of the door is one price. Then if you're customizing your cabinets with the pull out, that's another price. So they spent some money on this home. Let's go take a look at the uh, primary. Transitions into carpet. We've got eight foot ceilings. Looks like they added a lot of recessed lighting. Really decent size primary. This is a 14 by 12. Your coax cable is there. You have an option to put your TV here as well. So it looks like you have two sections here. You can put your bed and a retreat area. Six inches on the uh, baseboards. That actually looks like could be eight, but I think it's six inches. You got pocket doors that take you into the closet. Not one, but two. Take a look at this. And then you have your built-ins as well. Your attic access will be right here. Then let's take a look at the primary bathroom. Okay. First thing I noticed, I love the glass. This is a half inch on the glass here. So this is a quality glass. It's very thick. Nice cladding. Look at that. This thing just captures beautiful on this camera. It's all that lighting. You got the frosted glass. You got the fiberglass tub. Now one thing I've noticed here is that you have a lot of natural light that comes in. You have the skylight here, another one here, backlit mirror, two large vanities, 36 inches on the vanity, so it's very high, which is really nice. Then we have our private water closet. Now, if you notice, these doors are very wide doors, so they had to reframe these doors. And this is a custom solid door here. All right, let's see what else we got, because there's a lot going on. Love that fireplace. French doors that take out, take us out to the back. Now the home is also equipped with central vac. And what that means is that along the walls here, you're gonna see this, all right? You open this up, you stick a hose here, and then you can start to vacuum, which is really cool. But take a look at this architectural design here. Now we have a smooth finish on the ceilings with the skylights. Just nice and open. So here we have a den. It's located in the front of the house. And what's cool about this, this could also be an additional bedroom if you choose to. Okay, we have the skylights here. Then we have a pocket door that takes us right into the kitchen area. But I'm gonna take it back this way. Let's take a look at this beautiful island here. This is a marble, it looks like. Full 
full overlay cabinets. So we got the grays, dovetails. These are the diamond cabinets. Then this is to wash your vegetables. Look how cool this is. And then we have the cutting board. Let's see if I can take this out here. It's kind of hard to do it with one hand. So, and basically you wash your vegetables here. Now we have a 36 inch cook countertop, five burner, and then you're probably wondering where is the vent? So basically there's a button here. Let me turn on the button. There we go. Look how cool that is. So this would be your backsplash for all the oil and it sucks all the oil, the smoke right down there. Go ahead and push that. There we go. You did really a good job. Attention to detail. We've got cafe, refrigerator, stainless steel. This is all brand new. And then we have beautiful wine rack here. So if you guys have some wine, look at this. And what's cool about this is, check this out. You just pull these out right here, just like that. Definitely great to entertain. That's what this home is made for. I mean, just look at this. Imagine all the parties you can have here. 42 upper cabinets, double stack, looks like 16, 18 inches on here. Then we have the crown. Then we do have the lights, backlit as well, undermounted uh, lights as well. Beautiful front apron, stainless steel. We got some pull outs. Let's see here, trash drawer. Yep. Ooh, that's extra right there. Custom cabinets, configurations, they did a really good job. I mean, the attention to detail, you got the light rail, and then they sheeted this too as well. I mean, typically these are open. This is just an extra cost, but again, attention to detail, love that. Now let's take a look at the dining area. This is your formal. Got the double tray ceilings. Additional storage. Let's take a look at this. Nice. Let's see how large this pantry is. Because you know, we always need a large pantry. The frosted door. And looks like they built some custom shelving here. Okay. Look at that, that just looks gorgeous. Down this way, we have additional closet space. I would probably use this part of the, uh, the pantry as well. Bedroom, bedroom, then bathroom. Let's take a look at this bathroom. So this is the Avigo glass slide you can tell this home was just re completely remodeled they like literally gutted this home you can just tell just by the upgrades and what it has in this house here now, this is a pretty decent sized room too as well you got your coax cable right there then we have our walk-in closet mount your tv there Take a look at this bedroom. That's pretty cool. This one has your own bathroom. Now I noticed the uh, transition with the uh, carpet and the flooring, the tile. They're using Schluter's. Really gives that custom look. And for me, it's a clean look, so. Closet, cool. 
All right, let's see what else we have here. Coming into the laundry room. Good place to fold your clothes. Additional cabinets. Washer and dryer. All appliances are included in the sale of this transaction. Now let's take a look at this garage. This garage has been epoxied. Now you can tell this is a quality epoxy garage. The doors are insulated. Now if you take a look at the garage door opener, typically it's down the center. But here this is a lift master. These are the ones that are on the side. This is a custom one. And these are typically very quiet because it's almost like a belt drive. So they did a lot of upgrades here. Look at that. Park your Lamborghini right here. This thing would definitely pop, right? Here's your essential back right here. So they replaced that and also a water heater here. This is probably 75 gallon on this. 125 gallon, wow. This is a big boy. We have a door that takes us out to the back. This home shows very well, folks. And I love the location. Got another fireplace here. This is a gas fireplace. Then take a look at this, we have a bar section. So remember, this is a smart home, so everything is controlled by your tablet here. So here's the uh, tablet, which is really cool or you could just control it by the app of your phone. But now let's go outside. Let's see what we have outside. Because they literally resurfaced the pool. I'm gonna tell you right now, we got the uh, Pebble Tech, added a slide. Here's the uh, two car garage. However, you could always change this into a casita. Love this barbecue area right here. Look at that. This is definitely made to entertain. Very large lot. This is a 20,473 square feet. Look at this, it's all brand new here. Pools of Pebble Tech. This thing is gorgeous. Definitely uh, did a great job. Now, I love how this um, gradually just slopes right in. This, typically, this is what we call a beachfront. Then we have the uh, jacuzzi here and a diving board, folks. You could no longer get a home with a pool that's deep enough that allows you a diving board. This is grandfathered in, folks. We also have a water feature over here as well. Brand new pool equipment. You got the Pentair. Everything's all controlled through an app. Then we have three AC units, 14 here. We have three of them by Goodman. Now let's go upstairs, let's see what we have here. Matter of fact, you know what? Let me take you to the uh, two car garage. I believe this door is unlocked. So we're gonna go take a look at this real quick before we head on upstairs. Wow. So we have some stairs that takes us down. This is about 10 feet for the garage. Oh, I like that. Let's go up this uh, spiral staircase. I believe this uh, spiral staircase is about $4,500. These things are not cheap.
All right, guys, if you guys want more information about this property, I have a link in the description below. If you'd like to schedule a private showing, feel free to reach on out to us anytime. I'm Chuck, it's Chris Watt with Simply Vegas, and be blessed, folks. If you guys want to check out all our video home tours, we have over 1,800 video home tours. Just go ahead and click on this video right here. If you guys are in the market and you want to purchase a home and want to get started, visit lvhomeexperts.com. Scan this QR code right now. Also, if you guys just love real estate and want to get into real estate, go ahead and subscribe to our second channel. Until next time, peace.